and Gary. There we go, nice and spread out. Get your first couple of laps in before you everybody starts tying up a bit. A lot of these guys are sitting down in the C and D, maybe they're going to try to maybe get up into the B's, maybe C and D's, see how they do. Guys, they all got a couple laps in now early. Top leader is John Workman. He's got an early pace of a 25.504. Oh, sorry, John King took it on that corner. I don't know if somebody... So John and the, both the Johns are battling right now, but then John King has a bad lap, I think, because he went from first, second, all the way down to four. So now Workman is in the number one, 25.502. That's putting him around four spots up in the position 24 qualifying. So that's going to put him into the Ds. Watch the sweeper. Watch the sweeper. Clear. King moving back and he's up in the two. So that's John Workman, Ed King, Nick Blinkis, your top three. Right now the gap between one and two. We'll see what it is right now. 5.4 and back down to oh, Ed and John to switch in places. John King and Ed King. While their son switching places. John King up into two. He's 6.4 back of the leader, John Workman. And then Nick Blinkis is in two, but then Ed knocks him down to four. But that battle right there is only two and three, between two and four, it's less than half a second. So that is really a too close battle to call. You got Mark Hillier and Gary rounding up the order in the bottom. They're starting to fall away. Closest to, uh, to number four from five, Mark Hillier is 6.2. And Gary's right on his tail. Those, those guys are battling for to not be the last car on the track. John Workman, still your leader, 25.501. Not really, it's only moving him up four spots, he's sitting in 24, he's going to have to go 26 if he wants to get past Gordon or Anthony. Oh, Alright, John Workman's still pushing, but he's 25-503, 6.4 back is John King. John Workman's out there, he's got a pretty good gap, he's trying to see where he can get some seconds back. Nick, a really close battle between Nick and Ed King in three and four, they're battling back and forth. Nick Blink is right now sitting at three. And two. Oh, Ed had a bad, bad laugh there. He's down to five now. Mark up into four. And he's only 0.8 behind Nick Blink is. So Mark making a charge to see if he can catch. And he does on that lap. It's now Mark up into three. Nick Blink is 0.1. And he takes it on that lap. So those guys are too close to call right now. Three and four. Back and forth. Meanwhile, up front, we got Workman still hanging on. 25.503 is still his pace, 7.3, so he's got a good gap on second place, John. Let's see what the gap is between second and three. Nick Blinkus is currently in three. He's over a lap in lap time, so that gap's fairly large. So the one and two are starting to spread themselves out. Guys, 105 to go. Up next is going to be uh, Heat 2, and that's going to be Gord, uh, GT, Braden, Anthony, Gord Holland, and Mike Levi. Those guys, you're in the next race. 45 seconds to go, 45 seconds. John King trying to push a bit. He's got it down to 5.6. But your leader is still John Workman, 25-507. Mark Hillier moves up into the three. He can flick us down to four. He's 3.3 back now, the third place Mark Hillier, so everybody's starting to spread out a bit. Not really a close battle anywhere. Everybody's nice and spread out. John Workman. Doesn't look like he's going to get 26, so he's going to have to settle for 25th position and qualify after his last chance. And we're coming up to race time, guys, so keep going until I tell you you're done. Somebody losing it there at the start of the straight. That's race time. Mark, you're done. John 
Okay, you're done. Just waiting on Gary to go across the line. That's a race, guys. John Workman takes the win. 20